Hey everybody, and welcome to another video. In the latest big update in Rust, on the 2nd of August, we got three big things. The Swamp Monument, the Compound Bow, and this bad boy. The Rip, or Raheep. Bridget Hull, inflatable boat. Since you can find him around the island, me and Dragon DR cooked up a compact base design. So without any further ado, and wish me luck, this is the Richard Hull inflatable boat based tutorial video by Mr. Teddy P. Here we go. So one of the first things we found out, and as we expected, it doesn't fit through a single door. I, I want to come in, please. But we did find a workaround, so this is what we did. We're gonna start off with a triangle foundation, and we're gonna check for the max height. So just go all the way up with your mouse, and there's like a little point where you can still move your mouse up and down, and it doesn't move in height, so that's the max height you can build. We're gonna walk into the water, and keep checking the max height. And then when your water is like at the half, so like this, the half of the foundation, like in the middle, I'll show you where I'm looking at. Kind of like this. Just place it like there and then put three normal foundations attached to it. Go two white and then build the same thing back on the other side. Then we're going to put some foundation steps. We're going to make this stone. You're going to get out your gate and the wooden gate works better because then you can close up the top so i forgot to say this in the video you have to rotate the gate first so press r before you place the gate so you're gonna go i'm looking at the, the in the water on the bottom left and the right at the foundations and try to get the gap like as equal as possible go as close as i can and then place it you don't have to worry about not being able to place the gate you can place those really far away in the water so now you can close off oh you can close off this you can put a wall here like a wall here a wall here uh, you don't want to close it off on this side you want to go on the far side because you need all the room for the boat then you can close this off with a roof and now the problem is there's like still a gap here where people can jump in you cannot place floors here anymore you can place triangle foundation or triangle floors but then there's still a gap where they can come through so we found out that you can put floor um, floor frames here so you're going to have to need uh, you're going to have to get some floor grills or if you have it the hatchet and that way you can seal it up completely. And hatch. if I hatch, yeah, hatch, not hatchet, sorry. <laughs> Metal hatch, metal hatchet, yeah. Um, and then if I open this up, Jim can come in. And he plays the boat all the way in the end. Then you can get out. If you probably switch seats first, you can still close the gate. Of course, lock it if you want to. So the engine is still in the water, so you don't have to push it or anything. You can just open the gate back up. You have to jump in the water. You can mount the boat from inside the water or jump on the side, whatever you want. You can just go backwards. You should be good. Once you found out where the driver's seat is, of course. <laughs> and you can, that's hard. <laughs> it is possible to also close the gate from in the boat, but you have to do it in like one smooth motion. Otherwise, your boat gets turned around. Like almost happened to Jim. <laughs> so this is like the um, main core of the base. You could, of course, do different kinds of doors. You could place doors here if you want to. There is, of course, also the possibility if you really want to close this off because there's like a gap here and people could shoot from a boat or something else at your boat. If you want to, you can still place a triangle foundation here, <clears throat> then go down, place triangle foundations there, and then you can still close that off with walls. And of course, if you want to, you can then close this off too. And then no one will be able to look into your boat base. And then of course do the same thing on the other side. 
and you could build up anywhere where you want you don't have to make any more foundations just build up however you want to and then you could make a loot room up here of course make some walls here make an entrance here whatever you want that's up to you but it's like the core mechanic is this design with the gate and then the foundation floors or foundation steps and you can also do um, you could do three like this But then you have to um, make more foundations over here to close it off. And then if you open it up, you have a little bit more room for the boat. And you don't have to go all the way weird up that foundation. And you're still able to go all the way in and out without having to push the boat. But it just depends on what you want to do. If you want to have the room to walk on the foundations or whatever design you want, this works. So that concludes the base design. Take the core mechanics with the gate and the foundation steps. Build around it. Make it work. Thank you for watching. There are still a few clips of us messing around. See you in the next video. Okay, three, two, one. Try to go as straight as possible. I'm out. Still got one left. Okay, so it's a little bit further. So where are you? <laughs> I can't <laughs> find you. Are you stuck? <laughs> are you stuck? <laughs> kind of. I'm coming to help you. I'm coming to get in your boat. Get in your boat. Get in your boat. Get in your boat. Oh shit! <laughs> Jim, open the door. You take the other one. You take the small one. No, don't, don't push, push it. it. <laughs> <laughs> Jim, we're going out. Uh, we're not going out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's a one boat base. <laughs> I think so. Four, four push in. What the fuck? It's totally stuck. Okay, I'm stuck in the boat now. Drinking salt water. It's it's horrible. I cannot get up. I'm not pushing anymore. Don't. Okay, I'm fine. Nothing. Okay, I'm fine. Yeah, oh, 17 oh, pushing, yeah. 3 bud base. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Works like a charm. <laughs> well, we got two boats in. That's good. <laughs> yeah, and we got them out. <laughs> yeah, the second part wasn't great, but it worked. <laughs> <laughs>